Hello, I'm a volunteer with the Pennsylvania Senior Medicare Patrol with a message about protecting loved ones from computer scams. Now more than ever, we're relying on a virtual world, doing things online that we used to do in person, like banking and shopping. But this means that we have to pay more attention to being safe and keeping our loved ones safe while online. Here are some tips. Create and protect secure passwords. Remind your loved one not to reply to emails from people or businesses they don't know or emails they didn't expect to receive, especially if they ask for personal information, including social security, Medicare, bank account, or credit card numbers. Don't click on links that are not familiar and be careful about opening attachments or downloading files. Remind or help your loved one to install security software and to keep it updated. There are many antivirus programs available, ranging from expensive to free. Don't fall for tech support scammers. Look for a company's contact information on their software package or on your receipt to ask for tech help. Remind your loved one that when making online purchases, don't give out a credit card number unless the website is secure and reputable. A tiny icon of a padlock in the web address bar indicates a higher level of security. And you or they need to regularly check their accounts to make sure that all of the charges are correct. This message is from CARI, the Center for Advocacy for the Rights and Interests of the Elderly at www.care dot o-r-g or 1-800-356-3606. Help is always free and confidential.